Oh my god, look at this sexy ass piece of toast. Oh, I can't wait to eat you. Wait, I need grape jelly. Toast isn't the same without grape jelly. Hold on. I'll be right back, darling. Mm. Oh my god, look at this sexy ass piece of toast. Oh, I can't wait to eat you. Wait, but there's no grape jelly on this damn thing. Oh. Oh, whatever. I'm a fat ass. I'll eat anything. Come here, you. <clears throat> so, any peanut butter? Wow, that blows. No peanut butter. Whatever. Alright, dude. So, why are we watching this show and who the hell is creator? Huh? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was just waiting for this dope ass show to come on. <laughs> anyway, you're in for a treat, dude. This guy's name is Creator. I know, dude. I literally just said his name when I was asking you who he was. Now, who is he? <laughs> oh, <laughs> all right, I'm sorry. <laughs> I guess I just got a little too hype. Anyway, Creator is this guy who, get this, breaks into people's houses and lives there until the people that own the house come and then he tries to escape. Half of the time I'd say he's unsuccessful and there's like this, you have to have like a little smidge of luck that he gets out alive without any police charges. Ah, oh, it's just amazing. Okay, uh, dude, that's all fine and dandy and whatnot, but why the hell was I called here? I mean, that still doesn't explain why you called me here. Oh, well, that's simple. Uh, it's simply because I would like to place a bet with you, alright? And the bet is, from everything I've told you about this show so far, do you think the creator is going to escape? Like, leave out of here without any police charges or anything? Okay, wait just a damn minute. Police charges? What are you talking about, dude? Yeah, that's usually how these things end. Anyway, back to the question. Do you think he's gonna get caught, or do you think he's simply just gonna escape? I'm already placing my bets on him getting caught, since I know this show way better than you do. Hmm. Well, we're talking about someone breaking into a house. So... And a normal person like you would think that he's not gonna make it. Fuck it, I'ma just go out on a limb here and say he's going to escape. You know, just for the hell of it. Okay, okay, so you think he's going to escape. <laughs> I love making bets about this stuff. Ah, uh, trust me, you guys don't know anything about this show. I even conned your brother out of some money. The bet, though, was stupid, so don't ask about that. Oh, well, okay. <sighs> no grape jelly, and grape jelly is kind of what makes toast, well, toast. Uh, wait, what the hell is this? What does this say? Bomb goes here. Toast. What? Consumer go boom. What the hell does that mean? Consumer go boom, bomb go here. What? This language. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, that was funny. Kind of lightened my day now that I know that there's no grape jelly in the goddamn refrigerator where it should be. Anyway... What does he mean by toast, consumer go boom, bomb goes here? <gasps> Wait a minute. So are you telling me the toast that I made has a bomb in it and whoever ate it would explode? What? I mean, when did this person have time to do that? Well, I did. I, I, I really did leave it sitting out in the kitchen to cool for about an hour. So I guess he did it then? But why would some crazy, sick, twisted bastard do something like this? Put a bomb inside a piece of toast? Hell, that bomb must have been microscopic. Well, I'm glad I didn't eat it, but hold on. The toast isn't here anymore. Oh my God, someone ate it, and I think I have an idea who. <laughs>
Oh, ho, 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 ho. Uh, the show started. Let's see if you were right about him escaping. And if you weren't, then I guess I win. Uh, dude? Um, now that we're on the topic of bets and I just got reminded of this, uh, what the hell do I get if I win? I mean, that's the whole point of a bet, is it? Getting something like a prize or something if you're right? So what do I get? I mean, we'll see. I mean, we'll see if you're right, all right? Let's just wait after the show to discuss that, okay? Let's just watch the show for now. Hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Creator, and uh, <clears throat> I just woke up like a few minutes ago, and <sighs> things are not looking good. I wake up, and the first thing I wake up to is a bunch of noise outside. So let's go see if I can sneak my way into the bathroom. That is, if I can. <sighs> oh my god, dude. <sighs> I've been looking for you everywhere. <sighs> oh my god. That was a lot of running. Anyway, quick question. Uh, did you, by chance, eat a piece of bread? Toe specifically? No. Not that I can think of. Dude, don't mess with me, this is serious. Did you by chance eat a piece of toast? No. I, I, as a matter of fact, I haven't left here all day today and I'm finna watch a TV show and you're interrupting me, no. Oh my God, and I did all that running for no reason. Ugh. What the hell is his problem? I don't know, he might be on his period. Oh, whatever. Oh, oh my God, I gotta find whoever ate that bread before they kill themselves. Oh, Tyler. What? Oh, you saw the paper, didn't you? Yeah? What the hell is this? Well, I... I... You were the one that ate the piece of toast, didn't you? I... Yeah! What is this? Well, it's a... Wait, wait. What is this? Do, can you not read the paper? Dude, you know I can't read. I, I, I never went to school enough days for that. Oh, right, you're kind of messed up in the head. Anyway, it says, it's basically saying whoever whoever ate that piece of toast is donezo. They're just, they're done. They're gonna explode, is what I'm trying to say. So you're telling me that, that since I ate the piece of toast, I'm gonna die? Pretty much, yeah. Ah! Oh my God, dude. This is, this is not a running matter. You can easily go to the hospital. It's an easy fix. All right, Tyler, get over here. Tyler, get over here right now. No. Tyler, I swear if you do not get over here. No, you're not my dad. You can't tell me what to do. Hmm. Tyler, if you do not get over here right now, I will shove my nub so far down your throat, it'll be like you're deep throating a sausage. Fine. What do you want? Well, Tyler, you didn't have to run because there's an easy fix to this. You can just throw it up. Throw it up? What are you talking about? Well, think about it. You swallowed a bomb, so the only reasonable thing to do is just throw it up. All right, let's do it. I'll, I'll, I'll call you when I'm out of the bathroom. Or I'll be here because I don't really have a phone because my parents hate me. <sighs> Waiting for Tyler to come out of the bathroom. <sighs> Here's Tyler! Oh, 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 Jesus Christ, don't do that! I'm six years old, well, five and a half. I'm too young to be having a heart attack. <sighs> anyway, did you puke up that bomb? Yeah, I did. And afterwards, I had to go take a crap, and I ended up crapping my brains out, by the way. And after that, tell me why the heck my poop was red. I don't know exactly why your poo was red, but you probably need to get that checked out. Anyway, let's go check on your throw up and poop, I'm guessing. Well, I flushed it. Oh. Well, I didn't really need to see it anyway, so yeah, I guess that's that ship has sailed. Anyway, good job, Tyler. All right, I'm gonna go back to playing more COD. All right, guys, um, I'm finally in the bathroom after Several extremely long, awkward minutes of waiting in, uh, I guess, the kids' room. <sighs> Finally time to f 
flush myself down the toilet. Let's do this. All right, now my feet are in the toilet. Oh, this is so gross. And this is the second time I'm doing this. Well, the third time. And uh, let's just do it. What? I don't understand how I was wrong. So, uh, will that be cash or check? I'll go look for a job. Stupid TV show always forsaken me. Ugh.